Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have a huge, huge collective haul for you guys for today's video. As you can see, I've collected a lot of things within the last few months that I've just never gotten the chance to show you guys. So let's get into this haul. But first, I'm going to be doing a little Magic Mind update. I've been drinking this for seven days and this is my seventh day update. As you guys know, I've been trying to quit coffee and pretty much cut it out of my daily routine. And that's where Magic Mind comes in. You don't necessarily have to cut out coffee when drinking this little magic potion but I decided to just because I didn't really love the way that coffee made me feel it made me feel so jittery and the caffeine crush after a few hours was just not it like I found myself having to take a nap in the middle of the day just because I was so tired but to be honest I don't really miss coffee at all I know that sounds crazy because I would drink coffee like every almost every single day but seriously this has just kept me more focused and more energized with just the seven days so far i have seven more days to go i'm doing a total of 14 days so i will give you guys another update in my next video of the 14th day update and so far i'm loving the effects and benefits of the drink if you want to try magic mind for yourself and go on this journey with me definitely use my discount code baird20 for 20 percent off the entire magic mind website i'll also have a link in the description below thank you so much magic mind for working with me on this video now let's get back into the haul okay so i'm not gonna go in any particular order because all of the stuff that i have here is just like mixed together so I'll start off with this beautiful bag that I got for Christmas isn't it just so adorable I don't have a bag shaped like this so I'm really excited to use it it also has like a strap so you can do like a crossbody or you can just wear it like this but it's just so adorable I love the print of it this is like my first Michael Kors bag so I'm really excited and I just love it. It's giving like early 2000s vibes. What do you guys think? I think it's so cute. The hardware is gold and it's so, so cute. I can't wait to style this. Speaking of purses, I got like my dream bag. I love this so much. It's from Kate Spade. And the reason why I wanted this was because I wanted like a working bag, like to like go to a coffee shop with like my computer so i feel like this bag is just perfect and it fits my laptop and notebooks and pens and like a charger like it just fits everything and it's like an all-in-one bag and i love it so much and i love the color it's like a cinderella blue and it's just so cute obviously it's kate spade my favorite <laughs> designer ever and i love how their stuff is so cute but also very affordable and yeah i'm obsessed with this so these are the two bags that i got for christmas and because i have this right in front of me i might as well just show you guys i got a facial gift card to like go and get a facial done and i'm really excited because i've never had a facial before like a professional one so i'm really excited about that i'll definitely update you guys and let you guys know how it goes but yeah, that's another thing that I got for Christmas as well. I got this Victoria's Secret bombshell perfume. I've never had a Victoria's Secret like fragrance perfume before. I've always had like their body sprays. So I'm really excited about this. And the bottle is just adorable. It's so cute. I'm obsessed with it and I can't wait to put this on my vanity. Let's see how it smells. Oh my god, it smells so good. This perfume is going to be perfect for the upcoming springtime. It reminds me of the Marc Jacobs perfume that I already currently have and own, but it's just so good. It's It smells very sophisticated and sexy, but also like an everyday spring perfume. Oh, it smells so good. I can't wait to add this to my collection. So Chris got me <laughs> these Taylor Swift mugs, but they're not just like any Taylor Swift mugs. This one says, I survived the Taylor Swift Ticketmaster queue. Isn't that hilarious? Like, if you know, you know how much of a struggle it was and is to get Taylor Swift tickets. <laughs> but I'm so excited to go to Taylor Swift. Like, you guys, I scored sixth row. Don't even ask me how. Like, I did that but I just did so long story short I bought tickets and they were in the 100 section and then Ticketmaster gave you like a second chance for people that didn't get tickets so me and Chris both had our emails lined up so 
Chris bought the tickets for like the 100 section and then I got the tickets for the sixth row so I ended up selling the 100 section and now I'm just left with sixth row but like how did I manifest and get my hands on that like <laughs> like this has been my dream as a little girl to just like sit so close to Taylor in concert like this is just gonna be amazing and I can't wait I'm gonna vlog it obviously but this is the other mug that he got me it's so cute it has like all of her albums on here as like little books and I can't wait to like drink tea or something out of here I feel like it's so cute I already used this one actually I need to wash this one but yeah I'm really excited about this <laughs> it's really cute the next thing I got are bed sheets aren't these just so adorable they're from Target and they're like a floral pattern it reminds me of coastal grandmother coastal granddaughter vibes I can't wait to use these for spring I just need to wash them and then I'll be able to like put them on my bed but they're so soft I'm gonna link these down below because these are just like a must-have for any girly girl and they're like a really good quality too so I got the sheets and I've been needing new sheets for a long time because I haven't had any new ones for a while. So it was needed. I got a cute little bow for my hair. Believe it or not, I don't really have just a plain white bow like this. So this is just going to be so cute and useful. And I'm really excited to wear it for spring. Speaking of bows, I got this bow from Love Shack Fancy. Look how cute it is. It's just so adorable. It's gonna look so cute. I can't wait to wear this. I need to figure out where I'm gonna wear it, but I need to wear it soon because it's so cute. Also, I love when Love Shack sends their little postcards. They're just so adorable and cute. And I always keep them. Speaking of bows, <laughs> I got this bracelet from Kate Spade. And it reminds me of like 2016, like rose gold era, <laughs> but it's so cute. It's a bracelet and it has a bow with diamonds on it. It's just so adorable and I'm obsessed with it. I can't wait to wear this out. And it comes in this really cute little like dust bag from Kate Spade. Speaking of bows again, because it's a recurring theme within my life, <laughs> I have these bow clips that are made out of pearls. They're so cute. I normally never wear clips in my hair like this, but I'm really excited to actually wear these. So I think it's going to be cute like for spring and summer. So speaking of bows again. <laughs> I got this bow headband, I guess you would call it, to like wash your face and pull your hair back. It's so cute and it's from the company, the Vintage Cosmetic Company. All their stuff is just so adorable. So I'm really excited to wear this and it's really soft too. So I've been needing a headband to like pull my hair back whenever I do my skincare, my makeup. So I'm really excited about this. Next few things are makeup items. So I got this Ulta Beauty juice infused lip oil i've always wanted like the dior lip oil but i heard this is a really good dupe so i got this just to try it out because i've never tried a lip oil before and i'm not sure if i'm gonna like it so yeah i got the lip oil from ulta i got a few nail polishes they're from essie which is like my favorite nail polish company because all their stuff is just so adorable and cute i got two pink shades this one is called pillow talk the talk and this one is called fiji so i'm really excited to like do my nails i haven't done my nails in so long so it's like needed but yeah i got these next i got a brow gel and i've been needing to try a new brow gel in general so i got this one from european wax center it's like a wax center i think they're like across the u.s but they have like this eyebrow gel and I've tried it before and I fell in love with it. It's in the color light and I just really, really like this. And then I got a little sponge from e.l.f. I usually only use sponges from like Real Techniques. So this is going to be interesting to see if I like this one. Next, I got a viral makeup product from TikTok. I got the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. And it's supposed to be similar to the Milk Hydro Grip, I think. I think that's what it's called, but... Yeah, so I got this just to try out because I've been needing a new primer. The next thing I got is this brow gel. It's supposed to be like a two-in-one for like your eyelashes and eyebrows, but I just use all of it for your eyebrows. So it just like makes your eyebrows stay in place. I got these really cool and fun eyeliners, and I'm really excited to like play around with my makeup this summer and spring because I feel like I always do the same thing. So I'm excited to see what looks I can create with these colors, like blue and purple. So cute and I got the Essence Lash Princess Mascara and I've been wanting to try this for a really long time. A lot of people say it's really good so I'll keep you guys posted and let's see how it does. 
Right now I've been using the Maybelline Sky High mascara and that one's like okay. I just have never found a mascara that's like wow. So I'm on the hunt and then I got a few skincare products from The Ordinary. I got the Retinol in Squalene and then I got the Niacinamide and Zinc Serum. So these are just like essentials to have in your skincare. And the next few things I actually got in Sedona. And if you guys don't know what Sedona is, it's this cute town in Arizona. And I suggest you look it up and try to visit there because it's really unique and really cool. But I got a few crystals and I really want to get into crystals. This is just like my little New Year's present to myself. So I got citrine and citrine is the stone of prosperity and manifestation. I need to take it out of the packaging and I want to like cleanse the crystals and all that stuff. So I'm going to do that hopefully soon, but this is what it looks like. And then I got Cinnabar, which is also known as Cinnabite. And I love this, how it looks. It just looks so cool. I've never seen a stone just like it. And this one is ideal for creative people and attracts abundance. So I thought it would be perfect with like my YouTube channel and getting inspired and stuff like that. And then I got Opalite, which is the stone of happy dreams, which I just love the message of that stone. And it says that it also inspires creativity. So, and then the last stone that I got is called Pyrite, which is the stone of intellect and protection. And I got this one, you know, just for protection within myself, I guess. It's very grounding and it strengthens confidence. So I just got a few stones just to start off the new year the right way. So the next item are something really weird because <laughs> I live in Arizona. Um, but I got snowshoes because I don't have any. <laughs> It's so random, but these remind me of like Ralph Lauren, like the coloring and everything, but I really love it. It's This is like black and it has like this brown suede color. And yeah, I just really love these snow boots. I mean, there's not many cute snow boots, but I think these are really cute. And they remind me of like vintage Ralph Lauren. So I got those because they were on sale and I don't have any snow boots and it believe it or not it snows in Arizona so those can be very helpful for whenever I go to the snow and then I got some pajamas from Victoria's Secret I always try to get myself a pair of pajamas for like the winter season at Victoria's Secret because they're just so cute so I got this flannel thermal set it just comes with the long sleeve top with long sleeve bottoms and i just love the print it's giving a love shack fancy i went vintage shopping a few months ago and i got this olivia newton john vinyl but yeah i just saw it and i was like i have to get this because i love her so much rest in peace but i definitely want to start like a collection of like her music because i love her so much and she made grace what it is today and she is a main character so i love olivia newton john i guess we can go through all the love shack fancy stuff that i got so i got three pairs of superga sneakers from their collab with superga actually let me correct myself chris actually got me three pairs so <laughs> thank you to chris but each pair comes with this really cute tote bag and this is going to be so useful for like the beach, going on a walk, going on a picnic, going to the grocery store, you know, reusable bags, save the environment. So might as well make it cute and this is going to be so, so cute as like decor even in my room. But these three pairs of shoes are just, <laughs> I'm like obsessed. Like I've been waiting to do this video so I can wear them out. But look how adorable these are. They're like light blue with floral print. And the laces are like this velvet material actually not velvet it's like more of like a silky material and just the details of it in general are just amazing and i can't wait to wear these out so that's the first pair that i got the next pair are pink and purple and i love the laces because i've never seen laces like this before they're like sheer the laces remind me of like a fairy in a mythical land <laughs> like i don't know it just i just love their laces that they put on these sneakers the design is beautiful and i can't wait to wear these these remind me of the renaissance festival and i can't wait to go this year so who knows maybe i'll wear them there but these are just adorable and i'm obsessed with them last pair i was actually gonna buy these when i went to the love shack fancy store in scottsdale but I'm glad I didn't because they had a huge sale on the Superga website. So all these shoes were $20 each, which is just insane. But 
I was gonna buy these there, but they didn't have my size. So I think the universe was just like looking out for me so I don't have to pay the $150 for them. I got these for 20 so these are beautiful like I am just in awe over the design can we take a moment for like the laces the laces are just so so beautiful they're like this velvet material and these would be perfect for any time of the year but especially fall time because of like the velvet so, yeah these are just my all-time favorite so I think that this is the last item that I have to show you but I bought myself this Alosha Fancy pillow <laughs> I just I want to keep the packaging like I want to keep the box because the box is just beautiful because it says like Alosha Fancy and it's just huge but I probably can't keep it because it's just humongous <laughs> I got this pillow and I can't wait to decorate my room with it. It's a huge, huge pillow. And I was contemplating on getting two of these, but I decided like, no, I think one is enough. It could be like a statement piece on my bed. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna have like a whole new, almost a whole new like bedding over here with like my new sheets and my new pillow. So that was everything that I had to show you guys for my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I do want to give a shout out to Magic Mind one last time. You can use my discount code BAIRD20 for 20% off the entire Magic Mind website. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!